Hey everybody, Nick here from The Bearded Housewife. Today I want to show you this cute insert card that I have on the blog for everybody. It is my Happy Fall insert card. Isn't that cute? It comes with a cute little envelope. So that's what we're going to be making today on the channel. Um, there's a few things in Design Space that we need to do, so we'll head over to Design Space after I show you how to get the free file, and then we'll go ahead and get started making it. So before we get to how we get to the free file, I just want to show you the paper that I use. This is my standard white smooth cardstock from Colorbach. And then for the insert, I have my American Crafts cardstock, the Autumn cardstock pack. You've seen me use it on uh, the fall diorama card that I'll link above if you have missed that video. And then for the envelope, I have these cute bright spots cardstock pack from Colorback as well. All right, let me show you how to get that free file. Okay, here we are at my blog, thebeardedhousewife.com. We're going to head to the resource library tab. If you don't have access to my free file library, you can click Get Access. You'll fill out a form and then you'll be emailed the password. But um, we're going to go ahead and enter the library. Once you type in the password and click Enter, you'll be brought to all of my free files and projects. You're going to want to find number 93, that's the Hello Fall insert card. Click that hyperlink, download it to your computer, unzip the file, and then go ahead and open Design Space. Now that we have a new file, or I'm sorry, a new project in Design Space open, you're going to head to Upload, and then you're going to upload the image. If you need help, there's a card link right here at the top on the right hand side. Once you've uploaded your image, you can go ahead and click that image, and then click Add to Canvas. It'll bring our file into uh, Design Space. I'm going to zoom out just a little bit. Go ahead and click ungroup and then scroll down to where you find the envelope highlight that top layer we're going to change that layer to a score line highlight the group and then click attach i'm going to go ahead and move these things out of the way get the envelope and the insert layer out of the way okay now for the insert card itself you're going to highlight that score line, that's that top line, change it to score, and then the text layer, you're gonna to wanna to change it under operation to pen. And you can go ahead and change the pen color right here. I'm gonna go ahead and change it to moccasin. Then highlight that group, and then click attach. And that's it. You can head on up to the make it button You'll see the three mats in the mat preview. Go ahead and click continue. All of my cardstock that I'm using today is medium cardstock. So I've selected that and you can see that it's telling us to get our scoring wheel or scoring stylus, which you can change under edit tools um, and then our pen and we can go ahead and get started cutting everything out. All right, for this project, we're going to need a standard grip or light grip cutting mat, all of our different cardstock, scoring wheel or scoring stylus, our pen in whatever color you choose, Cricut scraper, Cricut brayer, and some glue just in case any of those little bits don't want to lay flat. I'm going to go ahead and get everything cut out, and I will see you when everything's all done. All right, I have everything all cut out. So first thing that we need to do is fold along the score line of that outer card. And then take your scraper and then burnish the fold. Okay, go ahead and open up the card and then take your insert and place it in the slits on the outer card layer. Go ahead and close the card and give it a good press. Now 
And right here, if you wanted to, is where you could add some glue just to make sure that all these little lines stay nice and flat. But for mine, it actually is um, looking pretty good. So I'm just going to go ahead and continue on and start working on the envelope. The first thing that you need to do is just fold along the score lines and then burnish the folds. Now you can open up all the flaps and add some glue to the bottom of the side flaps. Bring the bottom flap up and then press and you're all set. Your little happy fall insert card is ready to go. Just add your message, slip it in the envelope and mail it off to anybody who loves fall. How cute is it? It's so simple and it just screams fall to me. It just is such a happy, cute little card. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this. If you like this video, make sure that you hit like and subscribe so you know every time that I come out with a new video. Head on over to my blog, thebeardedhousewife.com for lots more cards. And I will see everybody later. Bye-bye.